What is going on, guys? Jada Black here. Shout out to everyone tuning in. Make sure y'all like this video because I'm going to talk about Trey Songs once again getting accused of something where there's smoke, there's fire, but he's been able to put out a lot of fires about himself. But in this situation, there is a female by the name of Rachel. Now, I knew of her. When I first heard about this story and her name was attached to it, I immediately thought, Twitter 2013. That's when she really took off uh, as far as being what I used to call a Twitter model. Y'all may still call them that. She was one of the well known Twitter models. It was her and a few other girls, but she was the main one. She was known as the Photoshop queen. She was known as the Photoshop queen, right? As a matter of fact, she went on Vlad TV to be interviewed by Vlad TV. That's how viral she went back then. This was before Instagram really took off, right? She was a Twitter model and, you know, she would be posting these photos and people would make fun of her for being a Photoshop queen. They put up these side-by-side -side photos claiming that, you know, she had work done or, she, you know, it was photos. But if you look on the left, that was her years ago, okay? But she, her body has uh, changed a bit since then. <laughs> and, uh, you know, she she's a little bit more shapely. You know, small waist, big hips, big butt, of course. And um, so when I saw her name attached to Trey Songs, as far as I'm putting his hands on her for rejecting his advances, I'm like... Trey Songz at it again. You know, all these fires he done put out, there's more coming, right? Now, everybody's innocent until proven guilty. I'm not going to sit here and say he's guilty, but this is becoming a problem with everywhere this guy goes, seems like. There are women claiming that, you know, they have rejected him and he's forcing, you know, the situation, so to speak. So let's get into this uh, Jazz and Brand article. Trey Songz accused of forcing himself on another female, harassing her after she refused to have relations with him. He isolated me, tried to make out with me, and put his hands in my mouth. Okay? Uh, and put his hands in uh, her mouth. A new woman has come forward with misconduct allegations against the R&B singer Trey Songz. Recently, a Twitter user by the name of Rachel took to her account to open up about her own personal experiences with Trey Songz. Trey Song's alleged inappropriate behavior in a thread she started off with. She might have deleted it, but still have it. They Trey tried to push up on her, and she said when she said no on the front end too, and it wasn't typical cat calling that you get every day outside, and his shit he isolated me to force himself on her and kissed her, and tried to put his hands in her mouth there they are not lying according to rachel who was producing music at the time she and trey songs met after she'd sent him a few beats and sat in one of his studio oh we have another i guess beat maker wannabe artist i wonder how she promotes her music does she promote on her ig you know with a picture of her sideways saying you know buy my beats i don't know I sent Trey beats because I used to produce and Trey and other artists asked me for a couple of beats. So she's a beat maker. I mean, she's out here, ghost, ghost, not the ghost right, but she's creating beats for these artists. I don't know anybody. Subsequent to her business endeavors, Rachel paid a visit to LA for a filming, a film casting, and the two ultimately reconnected via Instagram. The model actress then indicated that songs invited her to an industry kickback however despite rachel's platonic stance with the fumble crooner she expressed that he quickly attempted to mix professionalism with pleasure and things grew extremely in opposite in, uh, in opposite from there the alleged victim continued we met off of those terms i actually was in the studio while he recorded he recorded a song that night, I came into L.A. to get my steals for my IMDB. He seen me in L.A. on my IG, tapped in. I got invited to an industry kickback. 
I made it clear before I even got there, we are platonic in business. Yeah, that's going to work. <laughs> that's going to work. Although Songs allegedly assured Rachel that there weren't any erotic activities to worry about, the OnlyFans content creator claimed that upon her arrival at the event, the 37-year-old cornered her and became aggressive towards her, she wrote in a tweet. He said, it's not like that at all. Everyone here just chilling. It's a kickback. I get there. It's him, a producer, two girls, dark, and uh, two girls dark and he isolated me tried to make out with me he put his hands in her mouth we didn't f because no because one thing about me i stuck to my guns ultimately rachel removed herself from the uncomfortable setting and declined songs unruly overbearing advances he concluded she concluded by stating that she sh that she'd previously opted not to blast songs to avoid getting bashed for it. No, you get bashed if it's a lie. I mean, if it's the truth and it's your truth, then you don't have anything to worry about. I didn't say shit because people are so ignorant about victim blaming, but it's no way 60 girls should have to say an N word is a predator before we start being like, you know, what maybe he's weird that's sad well that's why when something happens you come forward so that they have that information so that when trey songs messes up again if this is true we already know that he's done this in this situation so it's it's harder and harder for him to get out of these situations if these women have come forward and already spoke i know it's not easy for them to admit these things but if you want some semblance of justice, you can't just be quiet and then, you know, one day randomly just drop all this information out here. See, she elaborated on her current views on the situation, adding that the incident only affirmed the number of accusations that have been pinned against them. I'm not traumatized by it, to be honest. This was more so to add validity to people still experiencing shit from him who are probably being doubted. I didn't let him pressure me, but I can see how girls not aggressive like me would cause his aggressiveness. Uh, following Rachel's refusal to intimately engage with songs, she said that he proceeded to harass her online. The word on songs are seen on the allegations. These are the messages here. One of the many claims that the bottoms up artists was uh harassing women just days ago he was outed for brutally uh going after a bowling alley employee which he has since denied at the top of this month his civil suit for an alleged assault case was dismissed after the statute of limitations was found to have expired additionally over the summer he was cleared of a case in las vegas listen he he keeps getting out of this because I guess it's because women are not coming forward. And again, I'm, I'm not going to sit here and say somebody's guilty because this person says they're guilty or that person says they're guilty. We need evidence. That's why if something happens, you have to speak out immediately because then you will have a trail of incidents when you, and when everybody comes out and says everything at once, it looks like a, it looks like a, a, a hit job. It looks like you're piling on just to have a get a moment. We've seen this with Cosby and even in a few other situations where it looks like the women are just coming together to just get this one man when he may not even be guilty. Now, I don't know the particulars. Listen, a lot of times when people say things, they leave certain things out too. He assured her he wouldn't press up on her. She could have declined to go to this kickback. You sent him music. When you sent him music and he found out what you look like, you should have immediately thought to yourself, yeah, he's looking to, he's looking to hook up. Cause if Trey songs, cause I'm assuming, I don't know when this was cause she's not really saying when this was, what date, what year, this could have been this year, could have been last year, could have been a couple years ago, we don't know. Like, if this dude has a reputation, maybe at the time he didn't, 
But if he has a reputation of doing these things, you got to be careful out here, man. You got to be careful. Out here. I'm not going to say that she's lying, but you do need proof out here when you go and say things. You know, there should be witnesses that were there at the kickback that could corroborate what you're saying. You could say that this person was here, that person is, that was there. You know, in these situations, you know, women, women are women are not dumb. You know, they know their surroundings. They know the people that are there. And that's the thing, like, when you're dealing with a lot of these celebrities, you got to be careful, man. These, a lot of these people are mixed up. A lot of these people are bored. A lot of these people have things going on. You got to be careful out here, you know. And Trey has gotten away with a lot of, sh you know, a lot of shit. I don't know how long he's going to continue to get away with it, but he's continuing to get away with it because, you know, these these women are not able to prove that he's doing these things to them. So I would say any women, because uh, you know what's funny is that there are women out here who are still dating Trey Songs. There are Instagram models out here dating Trey Songs. So they don't care. They don't think it's a big deal. It's unfortunate, but uh still got to be able to prove these things. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts. Uh see y'all next one. Y'all take care.